Startling new information tonight from the investigation into the Bucks County killings. Suspect Cosmo DiNardo is telling authorities he killed two additional people in Philadelphia in recent years. Authorities are now looking into that claim. Good evening, I'm Jessica Dean. And I'm Yuki Washington. Eyewitness News reporter Joe Holden is at Philadelphia Police Headquarters right now with more. Joe. Yuki, Jessica, good evening. And it is startling information to take in. Could these latest homicides have been nothing more but a string in uh, Cosmo Donardo's behavior? We know right now that law enforcement is trying to corroborate parts of his statement. Cosmo DiNardo, the admitted killer in the grisly homicides of four men found buried last week on his parents' expansive farm, apparently confessed to police he was involved in other killings, at least two more in the last five years, according to police sources. We're told the department is actively investigating DiNardo's claims made in that confession to Bucks County investigators. It was a plea deal that spared him from inevitably facing the death penalty. Spokesmen with the Philadelphia Police Department and the Bucks Bucks County District Attorney had no comment earlier Monday. Jimmy Patrick, Dean Finacciaro, Tom Mio, and Mark Sturgis were each shot and then buried after police say DiNardo lured them to the property under the guise of a marijuana transaction. Chopper 3 flew over the Solbury Township farm on Monday, a vividly different scene than just days earlier. DiNardo apparently made violent threats over social media ahead of the killings that began just after July 4th. A childhood friend posted to Facebook, quote, I grew up with Cosmo. We were best friends since the fourth grade, but grew apart due to his recent health struggles. He writes, unlike people who are passing judgment, I watched him change and struggle with his mental health. He was never the same after his accident. The Cosmo I knew for over 10 years would never be capable of anything like this. And police say that Cosmo DiNardo had the help of an accomplice, Sean Kratz. He is charged in three of last week's homicide, abuse of corpse and conspiracy. But did Cosmo DiNardo have more help? Not so much in the form of intent, but possibly in recklessness. I will see you in an hour with a legal expert for more on some trouble that could be spiraling out of this, possibly for some of his family members. We'll see you then. Reporting live outside Philadelphia Police Headquarters, Joe Holden, CBS3 Eyewitness News. Okay, Joe, thank you.